what is going on everyone testing something real quick here and we'll get started oh yeah I think we're good Alright, welcome back to Final Fantasy VI Return of the Dark Sorcerer Part 3. Been having quite a fun with this mod of the vanilla game. I played it once before a really long time ago when it first was released, and I'm playing it again about a year and a half or so later. And I think we just did, I think the last time we played, we just finished the desert area. And now we're going to move on to whatever is next, since I don't remember what it is. I don't think there's anything down here, no. This kind of has the same path, like if you were going to go to Zozo. That's a weird looking thing. It looks familiar though, like it's from some type of game. If any of you guys know, let me know what it is. Not very strong, whatever they are. Sea Castle. Can I even get in? What the hell is that thing? Hazmat. Best to clean up poison. But the toxicity levels are quite too high. Oh, that's right. So it's even so bad in the air that you can't enter. Alright. Well, there's nothing above it, right? Nope. Looks like there's something to the west. We can go there and see what's available. I'm not going to skip any fights and get as much XP as I can. Huh, I can't go west either. Aggro rate is so dang high, unless I'm just getting really unlucky. So I can't go either direction. Can't go east. Oh wait, is it right here? Doesn't seem like it's laid out very good if that's supposed to be like the forest part. <laughs> okay, it is. This music sounds familiar. Oh, it's from Chrono Trigger. I was wondering what the hell that was from. Okay. I got a feeling that tree is going to be an issue, so I'm taking him out first.
Yeah. Guess that was kind of a pointless attack. I just healed him. What the hell is that? Oh, shit. I don't know why I used the same guy. Did all 20 damage with that attack. Must be like undead related hands or something. It's healing everybody I attack. What is it? Spider. Oops. Whoa, whoa, wrong ones. I just want to see what element they are. Poison. So poison apparently heals those guys. Hopefully none of the other ones in here do that. Heal up a little bit here. That should be plenty for now. B-Rob, what's up? What are you up to? So I can't use regular attack. Still kill them. I want to see a pig seeing the ocean. I want to see the ocean. Clever. Just drinking and trying to finish up a Christmas present for your niece. 95% done with that. Cool. So wrapping up on Christmas time. What's this game called? This is called Final Fantasy VI Return of the Dark Sorcerer. It's a mod or a hack, whatever you want to call it, of Final Fantasy VI, which came out in like... I think it came out technically in like 1991, but it came out in the U.S. in 94, I think. But it's, really, it's just an old Super Nintendo game. RPG style game and it's a modification of that. So since it's something I don't typically play... Huh, so I'm supposed to go that way. Ah, uh, okay. Clever. But since it's something I don't typically play, there'll be a couple people that pop in here and there and probably say hi, which will be nice, but... I've only played this a couple of times on... I went the wrong way again on stream, so... Not going to be the most popular thing in the world, but it's fun. I want to try something different. So, do I want to go up here or straight south? Because I don't remember if they have this set up vanilla or not. Oh, don't run away. Oh crap, got him over here. So the people, the soldiers from the desert actually follow you, okay. Shout out to Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. Okay, seem familiar, reminded you of Nintendo games for sure. Yeah, the 16-bit era games.
Sweet, got some level ups that I needed. They're not like the ones back at the base camp. They must be elite reinforcements from Orionox, whatever you want to say. I don't want to say Onyx because it just sounds like the Pokemon. We're being hunted. Never be done until we're dead. And dancing around your corpses. Then let's pick up the pace. We can't deal with them and ghosts at the same time. Oh crap, I really have to fight zombies now? Oh, I didn't heal at all either. Do I have any holy water? I do. I might actually use some. Because I don't want to take on a ridiculously hard fight. I can probably take on two of them without using any more. Yep, forgot about that music and started playing in these types of fights. Yeah, it's been a while if you haven't played any old games in a very long time. I think you had a Genesis though. I don't remember you having a Super Nintendo. Maybe it was Kelsey that had the Genesis. One of you guys had it. Zombie bite. Oh, I blocked it. Sweet. Fang Rush should do it. Nice. Oh, I'm poisoned. That's good enough. What is a child doing in a place like this, wearing a full set of armor at this time? Onion Knight that were wept, wiped out. They get to go. It's a pretty messed up story, really. I heard he's searching for the man who murdered his mom. I think it may have been Kelsey or someone you grew up on Nintendo. Yeah, it must have been her then, because I remember trying to buy a bunch of Sega Genesis games off of her. Who are you? You cannot pass through here. Do you plan on stopping us? If you pass, you will die. Reaper, I'll help you through this mysterious forest for a price. Which is it? Your souls. So I gotta give him my soul for him to join? Okay, so he wants you to die naturally and then take your soul once you pass. It belongs to him. Why should we trust you? Yeah, that's... Yeah, what's to stop you from taking our souls right now or anyway? A reaper's word is an oath and a contract. If I break it, I cease to exist. Uh, sure. Half human and half dragon.
And that's why he can cast magic, apparently. A lot of text. So Eldrin's gonna sacrifice his life for us to move on. I mean, they have to say something because you can't have more than four party members anyway, so I guess that's his way of getting out. Oh, that's creepy. I'm in pretty decent shape, and I can't exit right yet. I'm gonna run around as the ghost guy, though. Where's that horrible music coming from? Okay, I spawned a bunch of enemies. His door is few shut, but how? Guess we'll, guess we'll go to the right because there should be only one cable car in there. Ooh, those are some freaky sprites. Okay, uh, what do I do? Guess I'll attack him. Poison heals him. Force. Let's try that. Drain shouldn't take any d. Yeah, shouldn't take any damage. That's cool. Powerful move. Ooh, nice.
Okay, so I can heal him outside of battle. I don't know if I can heal him inside battle because he's supposed to be undead. Okay, this is freaky. What's this? That was a terrible joke. Got a work, a lot of work done today. A skeleton. Sad. A shelter. Should I use it yet? Nah, I'm in pretty good shape. Not gonna bother the ghost. I believe most of these are just enemies, and if they're not, they're just shops, which I don't really need to buy anything either. Super high proc rat, not insta kill. Thing is gold. So I gotta run through all of these. Can I go around? No, I can't. Okay. <gasps> oh, almost made it past that one. Sweet ghost sprite. Is that one not an enemy or something? Nope. It is nice to have so many new faces around. It gets boring around here sometimes. Every single one of you. So you say you grew up on Nintendo. Do you still have your Nintendo stuff? And was it like Super Nintendo or just regular? Or was it like N64 and whatnot? Because you're older than I am, so I think I would have to guess that you grew up on Super Nintendo, but I don't know that for sure. Got a pink one, too. Run! Damn. I'm hoping the purple one's a merchant. Because maybe I do need to actually stock up on some potions and stuff. Open it was a merchant. Okay. It's just one, but it's a strong one. Let's do. I could do just do holy water and kill it, but I don't think that's necessary. And of course, I did it wrong.
spell. What's that do? Oh, it looks like Rasp. Uh, on the one guy I don't want to cast it on. And it was for a lot, too. Oh, well. Hey, one shot. Are you one, two? <laughs> nope. Merchant. Hey. Buy some of those. Don't care about poison. I'll buy one of those. Ten recharges should be enough. I will buy a couple holy waters because I used some earlier. Buy one of those. Actually, buy. Eh, I'll buy five. Holy water. I'm assuming that's an enemy. <laughs> I made it. Huh, I thought that was like the disconnecting cable car. Both Super Nintendo and N64, I don't have them unfortunately, but I wouldn't mind maybe getting some games again. Yeah, if you're just wanting to get it to play, I would recommend just playing on an emulator. I mean, it's cheap, basically free, and uh, you don't have to worry about taking care of anything. Like, this is an emulated game, but I have all the original hardware just because of nostalgic reasons. Certain consoles just cost a lot to play if you're wanting to play original. It kind of goes in waves because people get to an age where they want to reobtain what they had growing up, whether it was a certain console or a certain game or whatnot, and they want to play it legitimately. So you'll have like old 8 bit Nintendo games go up really high in price for a while in like a wave and then die back down. And then a year or two go by, goes by, and then Super Nintendo goes really high, and then goes back down. It's just because people hit that age, damn it, and they want to obtain those games again. So I bought a lot of these games I own ahead of that curb, so they didn't jump up in price. And now I think Super Nintendo's slowly starting to go back down, but it's still pretty expensive. N64 is not too bad, but I think that's also jumping up now because that's like 1996. So it's about time for it to go up. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> Trying to dodge all these things. Even though these ghosts are like super easy. Freaking one shot of that gun. Icicle. Okay, that one looks oddly out of place. Uh, I'll try to do a key blast. Sweet. I just don't want, if you get hit with zombie immediately with those, I mean, you're basically dead. That's the only bad part about the zombie mobs. Fangrush should kill that one too. That's the only reason why I used those holy waters earlier. One more potion. A little low on MP because that damn rasp. Uh, do I have tissues? Or not tissue. Which one's for MP restore? X ether. Uh, I don't really want to use that much. There is no escape. You are going to die soon. You will be just like us. Yeah, very true. I wouldn't mind having the N64, even though I love the earlier version. Yeah, I don't know what they go for right now. Uh, the console is actually incredibly cheap. It always has been. The controllers for N64 are stupid expensive, like more than the console almost. I think you can buy an N64, just the console for like 30, 40 bucks, but the controllers are like 20 bucks each if you want a legitimate controller. You can always buy third party ones, but they're not as good. Okay, that didn't tell me anything. Uh, huh. Die! I'm just fighting the same mob again, yep. Q. 
key blast its ass. Unless I do it wrong. The hell's time palm do? I don't know what red is. I don't think it's stop, is it? No, it's not. I don't know what that effect is. I'll have to see. I don't think it carries over either. What was that all about? Alright, so we're getting the cutscene with all the ghosts make you go up the ladder. Persistent bastards! Go on cable car jumping. And I guess I fell through that one. can't go back this way, right? Sometimes they'll hide little stuff like that, too. Since that's guy's rival, made a pack with Skull Chain Reaping, any wayward and welcome souls that come aboard, which of course includes you guys. I still don't think it's necessary to use a shelter quite yet. Stupid poison effect. I don't have any other knuckles to replace them with. I could just switch to single hand, but. <laughs> Eldrin. I'm gonna do a save real quick here. Save position file. Don't crash on me. A. So I think we're in good shape. Oh shit! Oh god! I apparently dodged all three of those. Hey, there's the onion knight. Surprised the controllers cost that much? Yeah, they've always been really expensive. I don't know what, why particularly that's the case. Maybe it just, it's like an analog that's hard to find. That and N64 has like the shortest game library, so there's not a lot of controllers out there maybe. That could be what it is, it's just supply problems. If you're wanting first party. Okay, so I gotta fight the guy. No mercy! Nice. 
Gave him confusion. Oh, and he came right back off. That was like the perfect status effect to have, too. Damn, I only get one shadow? He's hurting. Ah, oh, really? Now he has berserk effects. So all he's gonna do is just regular attacks. I can use the last of this ninja scroll here. Was that supposed to be like a blood effect? <laughs> it's all pissed off. He's still keeping it a secret for now. Ooh, look at all these food items. It's supposed to be like a birthday cake. Looks like a giant donut. What do they have to say? Ham and pineapple pizza. It may not be ever for everyone, but I like it. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of pineapple pizza. I understand why people like it, but it's just not for me. I don't like the sweet and savory. I'd rather just have the savory. This place rocks. How they know it's my birthday. I don't know what the other two things are supposed to be, like chicken and some type of vegetable, like maybe like a turkey on some lettuce and that looks like a mango of some kind or a fruit of some kind, pineapple maybe. Watching my figure lately, so ordered this enhanced mango. Hey, I was right about one of them. It's delicious anything but boring. Oh, it's a lobster. Ghost lobster. It's slamming, dude. Tastes great, even though it has, and it even has a cool name. Oh, I'm gonna get me some food too. Let's see what they give me. Nah, that looks pretty plain. Let's see what these last people have to say. Before my tragic passing, I was a big time restaurant critic, so I can get whatever I want for free. I wonder who he's trying to reference. Can't be Bourdain, he hasn't been dead that long. He's gotta be referencing somebody though. Best pancakes ever. All right, pretty cool. I like how they added all the characters to it. Usually it's just a big empty train. Gravelord's Force. We'll do a spread havoc. 
And I guess we'll just pick off what's there. I think I confused a couple of them. I don't think even I did that. I think the enemy did. Oh no, I guess I did. that do? Oh, there it is. Raises magic power. Okay. So it's like the earrings. If I have a couple of them, it enhances it more. Whoa, they move fast. Okay. One didn't attack me. I remember this being an issue. This room, this room reminds me of a problem, so I'm gonna save again. Sorry, the music goes away for a second when I save. Yes. All right. I know something ain't right about this room. Not another step. Hold on, Keeper of the Underworld, that treasure is mine. If I were you, I'd run away screaming now. He's supposed to be a giant onion. Yeah, he's a giant onion. Oh, those are like hella bad status effects. Oh, I missed anyway, sweet. So let's do a uh, Vega. Zero. Fuh. Holy crap, that hurt. What the heck? Why is it doing zero? It's also hard to find, like, Razor Leaf. Ah, uh, Pokemon reference, okay. It's also far to, uh, hard to find good deals on games and more people tend to know a little bit too much about what they have. So when I bought all the games that I have, or at least most of them, it was before that big retro gaming popularity boom. So, like, to find a damn good deal on a console you want is going to be really hard, especially something like Nintendo. This thing's gotta be close to dead. Ah, oh, really? Um, I guess I'll have to do a recharge. He can actually drain you too.
Okay, now it runs away. What an asshole. Stay away from that guy. Some Game Boy looking thing in here. I have a ghost detecting equipment and like to take pictures. I wonder if it's trying to tell me where something is. I don't know, I'm not going to do it too many times because it's going to drive people nuts, but... I wonder if that was what it was trying to tell me, but it could have just been making a reference to. Stop right there. Criminal scum. That's a reference to Oblivion. Prepare to die to my blade. All right, looks like I'm fighting him a second time. Well, he's attacking a lot harder now. How's that miss? Now he's back down. He's actually going to just come out and say it. Oh, I guess he will. That was just a random encounter. I'm actually gonna bail from this one. Whoa, almost was a little too late. Adventure time, okay. Alright, what's in the chest? Necronomicon, what's that do? Oh nice, it's like a full life. Alright, we got a mob. Alright, let's see how crazy hard this thing is. Oh, 
Alright, not too bad so far. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Vilifies pig, silence, and berserk. Toss everyone a heal real quick. Should be pretty close to the end of the train. third time now Are we gonna have some crazy cutscene now? Oh, it's his mom. This sounds familiar. Is this from Mario? I'm trying to think of where this is from. Like Mario 2? Sounds super familiar. So this is where we lose Reaper and get the little kid now.
let's see what type of gear you got. I'll get a vendetta. Talisman. What's a talisman do? Float region. Shell. Pig silence berserk. Eh, we'll go with the white cape. Random, randomly ends up in this zone. Boomerang, no. Don't really care that much about that. I'll buy a few more of these. Seven of those. Everything else, pretty much enough. Do I want to use a shelter? Eh, doesn't hurt anything. Let's see what uh, Ark's symbol is. I can't even tell what the hell that is, a bag? I have no idea what that is. I gotta stop this thing! all caps. I'm gonna assume that's the other guy, Mr. Grimm or whatever. Yep. Okay, we're starting off with Doom apparently. I got a feeling I want to take out Mr. Grimm first. Double miss. Must have a bunch of shadows up. Alright, let's throw... We'll do a bolt scroll. Decent damage. Still missing. Nice. Pega Vault. And do a widespread cure. Sleeping on the train track as it's moving. Bastard. Shatter, what's that do? And it seems has the blue mage move. Holy crap, okay, I thought that was like, oh, it's a zombie. All right, so I need to use one of these jolts. Uh, don't one shot me, I think it will though. Damn it, by three. Yeah, 
I should heal the other guy. Yeah, I'll have to after that. I don't think that acid raid will kill him though. Nope. That will though, fuck. Hmm. You're making this difficult. Poison. Don't tell me holy water will just kill it. I'll be kind of disappointed if that works. Holy crap, that actually worked. Why didn't I just do that earlier? All right, let me try to kill him legitimately though. I didn't even think about that until just now. Yeah, he's not doing so good. Oh, it came back. Huh. Maybe they thought of my little will the wisp. My guy in the middle is about to die too. Try to finish off the ghost. There we go. What? Brought him back. 185, so I gotta take him out again. There we go. Now he's down. All right, what if I do holy water again? Hey. Looks like we got some one on one. Ooh, that didn't last very long. <laughs> he got smoked. Freaky. 
Good damage. I don't think Force can be blocked by Runic though, because I don't think it's magic based, it's just a job ability. Yeah, it's not. Freezing Dust. Well, he is useless for a minute. It's a cool add-on on the skeleton because it's usually just like a telephone pole looking structure. I love like the little add-ons like that man, really cool. See all the poison people get on the train. Hey, it's the guy that risked his life earlier. Well, gave his life earlier, basically, to hold them all back. Definitely getting nostalgic with the graphics. What did you play on Super Nintendo?
I assume it's gonna just kick me out of the zone. Let's talk to him like 50 times. outside and we're right next to the next area. Ah oh, crap. <laughs> Got aggro immediately. Cockatrice. We'll do another hard save real quick. Save game position. Still haven't had a crash yet since I started playing this game again, so they must have fixed that. Some WWE stuff and TMNT as well, like Ninja Turtles. Um, I might have wrestling games. I don't recall. I know I have the the Turtles game. I actually think I have it pretty close to me. Let me see. I gotta check. Let's Uh, my mic volume seems really loud. That, or maybe it's eh, maybe it's not too bad actually. Yeah, this is my copy of Turtles in Time. I think that's the one you're talking about, Turtles Four. It's the most popular Ninja Turtle games on Super Nintendo. It's really expensive. I actually got really lucky at getting this at a garage sale for one dollar from an older lady that didn't know what it was. So I nabbed that actually back in Pittsburgh. I actually nabbed it before I moved to uh, Nebraska back when I was still living in Pittsburgh and basically was doing nothing for like four months. This is typically where you would lose the ninja character, but I don't know if that's going to be canon here. He actually is going to stay. Cool. Why not? Nice little camera angle. Oh crap, Pokemon reference time. Alright. Let's do I should have saved my damn bolt scrolls. Only got one.
You definitely miss Pittsburgh for sure. Uh, if I was younger and I had the energy again to be a little wild and whatnot, I'd, I wouldn't mind going back to that life, but I definitely couldn't go back and do it now. I'm too old and too boring. <laughs> there were some things I still wish I did, but I got to do mostly what I wanted. <laughs> it guarded itself. Sweet. Just gotta keep it with those runics. Locked. Ah, oh, that doesn't get blocked by that move. Crap. That might kill uh, Oboro. Yep. Ugh. Whoa, desperation move went off. Nice. Well, I definitely don't miss some of the party scene we used to. Don't mind going out. Just not like that. Yeah, absolutely. Too old for the partying anymore. See if he'll do his desperation move. I think it's like, oh crap. So they all come back at once. Zero, zero. Hmm. This bet might be to take them all out but one. the dancing at 505. I don't miss 505 at all. I hated that place. I like the bonfires and stuff that we did, but I don't like, I didn't like any of the bar scene unless it was quiet. Havoc's gonna do like no damage. It's gonna do like twenty damage to everybody. Thirty seven. <laughs> I don't think that's quite canon. Huh, 
I still come back. So maybe I should just gun for the center? I would assume that ads would stop coming eventually. I mean, I got no choice. I mean, I could just say screw it and use the bolt scroll. Why not? I got nothing to lose. Bam! I wish I kept more of those. Definitely more for bonfires nowadays. Agreed on the choir to bar scene. Yeah. I still do bonfires with some friends every once in a while or I'll host one, but it's very seldom. Still hang out with uh, a few people ah, from the college days. Just not very often. Frozen beam. They're gonna one shot me. Maybe I should risk a desperation move. Go for it! Nope, didn't do it. Yeah, I was not a huge fan of the fret houses either. I think I only went a couple of times because someone wanted me to go. And if I wanted to mingle and whatnot when I was single, but I never, after the fact, I was like, nah, absolutely not. Desperation move. He's gonna summon back his ads any second. Oh, Nino, ah, that's gonna kill him. So, some bath. I will have to do a recharge, followed by cure everyone, followed by. And we'll see how the cure does. Uh, I don't really like that either. If I had to choose one, we'll go for Ronin. Huh, Runic carries over. That's nice to know. Be close to the end. I'm surprised he hasn't summoned his ads back yet. Hmm. I don't really want to do havoc either. Havoc's based on your HP. Well, I guess I should have done it in retrospect now that I remembered that. Frozen beam. The one shot of Boro. <clears throat> Some of the people that does it with frat parties, man, were out of their damn minds, even back then, for, like, young kids. I'm gonna heal him and then try to do a Havoc on top of it. Hey, there's the ads. I was wondering where the hell they went. Don't miss! Be some good damage if it'll land. Damn it. Hmm. I guess I'll just have to keep gunning for the middle one. Hey, there we go. Dude 
fishing. All the star you use floating by. Is the star me going to be at the end? It is! Just with a different color palette. So we lost a boar in the water. How about you, Ark? So who's Gao's replacement then? Don't recall there being any, so maybe there isn't one. Talk to this guy while I still can. It's hot! What are you, stupid? Yes, yes I am. Any villages to the north of here? That's my fish! It looks like I recovered fully. is lower why is it better for him consumes MP for extra damage I guess I can get two of those for him don't care about the hot cleaver you think you can handle the college kids at the bars now keep up with uh, their energy Yeah, none of the armor seems to be any good. Cat, what do you want? You want an attention? Is that what it is? We still have one of the cats. We used to have two, but uh, we still got the one cat that's laying on my lap from my college days. Legend around these parts about a mysterious race of people that live in the north lands of the mount north of the mountains. Any unique item? Take a shelter since I used one. I need five of these. About to run low on dough. Silence. Take a couple of those. Everything else I don't really care that much about. Oh, potions, yeah. I might have to sell some stuff. You think you could, depending on the night? You still got that kind of energy? Oh, I definitely don't want to sell Necronomicons. I don't want to sell my relics either, though, if I can help it. Uh, none of this stuff's really worth selling. Should be like some scrap metal laying around. Scrap metal. Sulfur gill. Yep. There we go. Hey, there's some dough. Just gonna drop 10 P. Here two of those. There we go. That gave me a little bit of money back. What about me? Uh, back then, yeah. Like I said, there's a lot of stuff I still wish I did back then, but I got to accomplish most of it. If I did it today, it wouldn't go well, I don't think. My tolerance is way lower. Like, I used to drink all the time back then, and over the past few years, it's just gone lower and lower, and if I did what I did back then, I'd probably pass out or end up in the hospital. <laughs> Gonna learn a story. I think it's just gonna tell me where, oh, it's gonna tell me about the village of all the, oh no, it's not about the magic users. It's just to get to the city that's close to Frost.
Yay, elixir. Sometimes, but rather would do something chill. Yeah, me too. I have all these desks that you see behind me with a variety of different chairs and what with different consoles and stuff hooked up to it. And you can actually get to my basement without having like actually enter the house itself. You can like put a code in and I can change the code to a different number whenever I want. And I'm gonna call this area the dungeon once it's done. I still need to completely finish this man cave part, but it has like multiple rooms down here and whatnot. And uh, I'm gonna start doing some parties down here, I think. I've done a couple already, but nothing big. Terry, I think these are just supposed to take over like the teenage couple. But I do plan on uh, having some like old school land parties if you ever did that back in the day. Ninja Sight, Speed Boots, Haste Boots would be nice. I, I'm skeptical to skin, uh, spend money though. Who the hell's in here? Is that Link? The Power of Gold, sh yeah. So they got a, a passed out Link in here. If I did it now, I would also have to drink like really watery. What would happen? Oh, just a cutscene. I'd have to drink like really watered down beer if I did it today. Which I'm not usually a huge fan of. I like how the kid's wearing his onion knight armor. Unless this is supposed to be like not the village he used to live in, it's just how he's dressed. This kid's all pissed off because he thinks this kid's checking out his girlfriend. <laughs> These kids are assholes, man. Hiding inside houses is off limits, so I gotta find these kids, I guess, to progress. Shouldn't be too bad, it's a small zone. Alright, I'm gonna guess behind this house for the very first one. I can't even get behind it, so never mind on that. You were always like the more. I don't wanna say like. I don't know how I wanna put it, like high tolerance person, so I think you'd be able to do it today versus me. You love you some good good beer though? Yeah, me too, I just can't really handle the hangovers anymore. So sh there was one behind the house here. What's this old dude doing? Require mana to exist, if they run out they instantly die. So some mobs die if they run out of MP, I mean that only matters on certain things. Oh, they're not inside houses, that's right. So let me try behind here, nothing. I don't remember this guy being here. Oh yeah, he was, he was telling me the damn story. All right, kids, where are you? Can't be that hard to find. Yeah, I need to get a big poster and for the dungeon door. I haven't done that yet. I've got posters that are slowly starting to go around the man cave and probably tomorrow I'll actually buy some more. It's payday, I'll buy a few more posters until I get this whole office covered. And it's gonna take a lot because there's like four different rooms in this basement. How about this tree now? How about up here or this tree? That item, some of these kids really damn well back in here. I got an item trying out the zone either because I don't want it to reset which I don't think it does on here but you never know 
Where should I look, chat, the couple of you guys watching? I'm not streaming Final Fantasy XI today, sorry, but I'm trying something a little bit new. Part three of this series. I'm having a lot of fun with it. I'm trying to find where these damn kids are. I, mean, I only found one. There's like five of them. Where the hell would they be? Ooh, I zoned. Ah, crap. Hopefully that doesn't reset them. Ah, oh, I gotta do it again. Oh well, at least I know where one is. You could still have a few and be good. Uh, it depends what a few is. <laughs> Everyone, that's a loose definition. So I know where that one was. There wasn't one back here. How the heck can I only find one? They said inside a house. Oh, wait. Tiffany. Okay, there was one right here. I didn't even see them, though. I clicked all over that area, and there was none. So I got two. What about behind this house? Hey, there we go. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. That's three. Oh, I see this kid sticking out right here. Is that all of them? One more. I'm catching them like lightning quick now. How about behind this area? This would be a good spot. No? This tree? Hey, there we go. I think that's all of them. Okay, I found them way faster that time. There was a couple of times where like the missus would go out of town this year and like the three days she was gone I'd pick a day and I'd just get like hammered hammered but still it it a it was very weak stuff I had and it still wasn't that many if I pushed you know uh, in the entire day if I if I pushed eight or nine that's like going hard and then I'd be hung over for over 48 hours the next day. I love me some beer. I just don't love the hangovers anymore, man. They feel way different when you're almost 30 versus when you're 20, 21. You drink a 30 pack and get up the next day and go jogging, eat some food. And an hour later, you're ready to do it again. Now, if I do a third or a quarter of that, I'm hung over for two days. I'm sick to my stomach. I have a terrible headache. And it sucks. <laughs> I think part of it too is just uh, it drops your immune system a bit so there's always that fear of you can get sick afterwards and everyone's afraid of COVID and everything else so there's there's a lot of reasons alright is there anything else I'm missing in here before I head back out I said there was that injured guy in the one house, but I think he's for the tenature item. Whatever that item was in the vanilla game that gives you MP every time you take a step. Yeah, this guy. We'll send this one letter out for this guy and we'll, we'll go back later. I'm not going to stand here and do them over and over again. 500 gil, damn. All right. <laughs> what a jip.
Still doesn't take you very long, about a day or so. Yeah, they just feel way worse. It's not the fact that, you know, if I know I'm gonna have a hangover the next day. It's the fact of I'm gonna have a hangover that feels ten times worse than it used to is my issue. But maybe it's kind of a blessing thing because I wasn't always making the best choices or saying the right things when I was tanked. I was I was never like the angry or the sad drunk. I'm like that. I'm always I was always the happy guy, but I was a little too happy sometimes was the problem. Which we all can get like that, but yeah, I don't miss that either. So yeah, there's no gal on this section. He's the gal part. That underwater helmet should be around here somewhere. Let's see if there's anything unique about this area. There used to be little trigger points right around in here. I'm not seeing one being activated. What about down here? Nothing. Okay, what about over here? Nothing. They took out all the ones from the vanilla out. Alright, let's go up through here. Nothing. So they must have only left in the one big one. Or they took them all out. Let's see. Something's buried. No, I guess they left that one in. Found it super quick. I do have a... I don't have any beer right now. Actually, I haven't bought any in days. and I don't have any. I haven't had any in a week or so. I have a bottle of Bailey's Irish Cream somewhere. In a freezer. I have like three freezers in this house, so it's in one of them. So I may get into that at some point, but I usually have one bottle a year. This color scheme's a lot better than Bannon Falls was with the bright green pink crap. I like the little sunset feel, it's nice. Uh, he's not even scared of it. Oh, I love the music. So, a little black mage and a bunch of fish. healing the fishies you're a black mage you're a complete oxymoron ox oh, I almost said oxyclean you're a hypocrite <laughs> something you're a giggly happy drinker yeah, everyone that we hung around with was basically like that I can't think of anyone who was like a huge pain to be around when it came to that Some cool sprites, man. I love it.
Whoa, freaky. Are you still the happy giggly drinker or are you the put someone in a sleeper hold? <laughs> I don't know how you even could if you're like four foot eleven. Yeah, I'll stay going right. I don't think if you change directions it really makes a difference in this version. Oh, that's supposed to be the Sahagans, man. I still have nightmares of those. And Final Fantasy XI hanging out in Sea Serpent's Grotto for like six months straight. It's all it reminds me of anymore. that sound it's a damn mermaid oh is that the siren sound from the original game like the esper I think that's what that's from Yeah, little mushrooms. Little Mario 1-Up mushrooms. Tunes fall. Get rid of all these bad status effects, poison, and he's got plenty of MP to a cure. We're almost to frost, man. We're almost on the home stretch. This one of the trifecta mini quests. This one's by far the longest. This one's like 80% of it. Ow, I hurt a lot. Ow. 
had like a cramp. Ah, man, that hurt like hell. That's another part of getting older that sucks, man. Just random things out of nowhere to start hurting. And you're just sitting there. You're not even doing anything. particular bird seems to be in, transfixed with the generic avian feature. I have no idea what that means, but maybe it's a reference to something. I was wondering why the bird was just standing there. It's the only reason I checked it. No. No. Let's see if they had anything different. Anything up here? I was going to see if there was like a secret zone. Sometimes they add stuff like that too. And there's another game I'm going to play after this one that uh, someone in the Zen Garden Discord recommended that I play. It's a Chrono Trigger. If you're a huge fan of Chrono Trigger, it's a mod similar to this one, but I think it's actually a little bit more unique as like a sequel instead of like a, a hack or a butchering or however you want to call it. So I'm going to give that a play actually after this one and I've never played it before so I got to get it working first and then I'll uh, I'll give that a go wait what 10 steps without getting attacked by something yeah I think they're acknowledging the high aggro rate That is a good point. Why are elixirs in like 90% of the clocks? I always wondered that when I first played the game as a little kid. Like, why is it like this? Who puts liquids inside of a grandfather clock? This one's not vanilla. There's a second actual uh, entryway here. Let's see what this leads to. Vacant house. Rabbits! Okay. You know what? I bet there's a secret entrance down here. Nope. Come on, there's gotta be. Or is it just a rest area? Uh, usually, they wouldn't just put a, a house in here for no reason. Really? There's no like secret shop or nothing? That's very surprising to me. Once this year, I slept wrong and hurt for a couple days. Yeah, I've like laid in bed and did like the whole big stretch, and then like halfway through the stretch, just go. Oh! And something locks up and muscles start getting tight and hot and hurting. It's messed up, man. It was never like that before. Who is this guy? Oh, am I investing in this dude? Yes. I think he helps you out tremendously in the world of ruin because there's something like that too in the vanilla game where you can invest in somebody's shop so if when time goes by a couple of years later they do really well and you can get like a lot of good deals on stuff Kinji knife what's that too a ninja's best friend earth elements I'll take one just in case I start fighting some wind stuff Learn to spell, which I don't really need to right now. Do, 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 do. Ethers are cheap, man. I always have a decent stock of these in case I find something that I'm not ready for, or something that petrifies a lot, something that poisons a lot, something like that. What the hell are these things? This inn is haunted. Are you brave enough to find out? Coast don't believe in you either. <laughs> wow, that's brutal. This They said this place is haunted, so am I supposed to like sleep here and maybe get something unique to happen? Let's find out. Uh oh, something is happening. Okay, some freaky ass sounds. Okay. What the hell did that mean?
it's okay. Maybe it was just a cutscene? I don't know. I expected something to happen. They didn't take any of my money. I'm just gonna guess that it was a cutscene. Should I check the stables? Eh. So if I take that boat, it'll take me back to Frost. And I think I still have to go through the boat itself because I don't think it just gives you a straight ride. What the hell is that thing? Whoop, whoop. Looks like a Pokemon of some kind. All right, we'll take the boat ride. I think we got enough crap. Let's roll. to the main town. I'll let you guys read this, and you can always watch the video later and do pauses if you really want to read the story, but it's pretty vanilla if you've played the original game. I still don't like reading a lot of stuff just because I don't think that it really helps with the experience. I don't really like being read to either, so that's why I let people read for themselves. You may hear me say certain key points, but to do like voices for different people and stuff, I've never really been into that. So sorry if that's your thing.
it's still pretty dang text heavy. I feel like reading great, but I usually don't like extremely long parts of text. Some weird looking scorpion thing, a couple gold soldiers. I don't know what the thing in the middle is supposed to be. Do a quick save here. Still no crashes. You dog. We meet again. Caught one of the big battles going to be down here. Figured I'd offer my services for a small fee. Two thousand gil. Sure. I can swap out with all the people. Oh yeah, sweet. It works pretty well too. So we are right about hours a little over two hours so I am probably going to end it right now and then we'll do part four probably either tomorrow or sometime this weekend and we'll hopefully get some ground going this is a long game man three parts in we're only not even halfway through so I'll plan on doing these a little bit more instead of once every like week and a half or so and we'll get this game done but it's a really fun game hope you guys are enjoying it and until the next one, so long, take care, and thanks for watching.